Hello world, welcome to Decode Mania. I am Sahil and you are watching 27th video of the project User Management System with Admin Panel. In previous video, you have seen that how I have fetched all the deleted users from the database and displayed in deleted users page. And we have also seen how to restore an user. Now in this video, I am going to show you how to fetch notes of all users from database and display here in this notes page. Okay. And then I will also show you how to delete a note okay so let's start so first open your project now from here just open this file admin hyphen notes dot php okay now here what i will do is just remove this h1 tag okay now next what i will do is i will design a card okay so i will use the coding of this file admin hyphen users dot php file okay so from here just copy this column coding and just come here and paste okay now here i will change some class so here i will write border secondary okay and here in bg i will write secondary now here just change the card header text to total notes by all users okay now next here i will change the id also so all notes okay if you save this and go to the browser and refresh then here you can see the card okay now next what i will do is i will send an ajax request from this file to the server to fetch all the notes from the database okay so for this also i will use the code of admin hyphen users dot php file okay here i have already defined a function so just copy and come here to this file now here what i will do is let's create a script tag now inside this script tag first i will use document dot ready function now inside this function i will paste now next just write fetch all notes ajax request and change the function name also fetch all notes sorry fetch all notes and just change the value of action key to fetch sorry fetch all notes okay now next what i will do is i will go to this file again and copy these two cdn links and come here now paste okay save this now next we have to handle this ajax request into this file admin hyphen action.php file but before going to handle this ajax request first we have to define uh, a method inside this admin hyphen db.php file to fetch all the nodes and some users detail associated with the nodes uh, so let's define a method so here i will write some comment first fetch all nodes with user details or just write user info okay now here in sql here in sql variable i will write sql query select here i will use join okay because uh, i am fetching from two tables okay from notes table and users table from notes table i i will select all the notes detail and from users detail i will select some uh, users detail like uh, uh, username or user email okay so let's write the query select notes dot id sorry id comma notes dot title comma notes dot note okay and notes dot created underscore at and uh, notes dot 
updated underscore at now i will select from users table so just write users dot name and users dot email okay i will select two column from users table now next i will write from notes sorry here i will use inner join so just write inner join uh, inner join and write the users table and then i will use on now we'll match the id of of notes uid column with uh, users dot id column okay now next i what i will do is i will create a statement variable and using this i will use con then use prepare and just use this sql variable here now next we have to execute the statement so just write a statement then just write execute now we have to grab all the rows so i will use result variable and using this statement i will call this fetch all method and here i will use pdo fetch sock okay now next i will use return result okay save this now next uh, open this admin hyphen action.php file here we will handle the uh, ajax request okay so here what i will do is just write a comment first fetch sorry handle fetch fetch all notes ajax request okay now here i will use the same coding that i have already written here okay so just copy this up to here and paste okay now next what i will do is just i will change this to fetch all notes okay because if you open this then here i am sending fetch all notes a string okay from this action key okay and this is this is what i am checking here okay now next what i will do is i will not use this path so just remove and here we have to use this method okay okay so here i have not written function name sorry so just here write public function uh, public function fetch all notes okay now we have to write all this code inside this function so just cut and paste okay now fix the indent now i will use this method here okay so just come here and paste just remove this parameter now next what i will do is i will change this data to note okay and change here also note i will not use this if a statement so just remove now next what i will do is i will change the column names okay so first uh, first i will display the note id so i will use this hash symbol and next i will display username okay so just write user name and here i will display user email so just write user email and next i will display the note title okay so just write note title and here i will display the note so just write note and here i will display written on written on and here i will display updated on and here uh, i will use a action to delete the note okay 
now next what i will do is first just remove this td okay now first i will display the note id so so keep this same now next i will display the user name so this will be also same next email so same now next i will display title so just write title and next i will display note okay so just write note and next i will display created underscore at okay and next i will display updated at okay so just write updated underscore at now here in this td i will uh i will write uh, sorry i will change this title to delete note okay delete note and here i will use text in danger and i will change this custom class to sorry delete delete note icon okay and here i will use a font or some icon okay so just remove this class and just remove this text and here just use i tag okay so here just use i tag close the i tag now inside this i will use class now in class i will write fas fa trash alt and fa lg okay save this now here also i will change this text no any note written yet okay so just write written save this now next what i will do is just come here to admin hyphen notes dot php file and here you can see i have used so all notes id so just copy and paste here okay save this now go to your browser and refresh okay so here you can see all the notes of user with uh, some user info okay so this user has written this note and this user has written this note okay so all the notes are displaying here in table format now next what i will do is uh, i will delete a note when we click on this delete note icon okay but before going to delete let's check go to user area and sign in with this user and then let's try to add a new note okay and here i will write web development okay and let's copy and go to here search for some text okay so just copy this text come here paste okay now click on add note so you can see a note added successfully okay and this uh, note is added by this user okay wolfmania user okay now if you go here and refresh then then you can see this user has just added a note and note title is web development and note is this written on this date and time and updated on this date and time okay so whenever any user writes a note in user area then notes will be um, notes will be displayed here in notes page okay now next we have to work on this delete note okay so for this let's come here and for this also we have to send an ajax request to the server so i will use same code of admin hyphen users dot php file so just come here and just copy this ajax request 
copy and go to admin hyphen notes dot php file paste here okay now let's write a comment delete note ajax request okay now here we have to change this uh, class because here if we come then see uh, here we have used delete note icon so just copy and paste here okay now next what i will do is i will change this del underscore id to note underscore id okay now next what i will do is uh, i will keep all the same and here i will change this to note underscore id and here also just write note underscore id okay and here okay so note deleted successfully and here we have to call this method so just copy fetch all notes and paste here okay save this now next what i will do is we have to handle this ajax request inside admin hyphen action dot php file okay but before going to handle this first we have to define another method inside admin hyphen db dot php file to delete a note from database okay so here just write a comment delete a note of an of an user by admin okay now here just write public function delete note of user and here just use id as parameter now just use sql variable and in sql variable just write sql query delete from notes okay where id equal to this id and just create a statement variable and using this i will use con then use prepare and pass sql variable here now we have to execute the statement so just use execute and bind the parameter id with value dollar id okay now just use return true okay now come to this action.php file now next what i will do is just go below and here just write a comment first handle delete note of and user ajax request okay and here i will check a condition if it's set and super global variable post and here i will write note underscore id and first we will grab the id so just create a variable id and using super global variable post here i will write note underscore id okay now next using admin object i will call this method delete note of user and here pass id okay now just save this now go to your browser refresh now let's try to delete a note okay so if we go to users area and click on home then this user has four notes okay so let's delete this note this 11 uh, id note okay so if we go to notes then here is this note so let's click on this then here when we click on this uh, delete icon then we are displaying first a confirm and dialog that are you sure want to delete if we click on cancel then this dialog will be hide and again when we click on this yes delete it then you can see note has been deleted from this uh, this page also and if we come here and refresh then from users area the note has been removed okay again if we come here and delete this note okay 
and if we come again here and refresh then you can see uh, the note has been deleted from user area also okay and if we go to database and click on notes table then here only uh, four notes are present okay and if we come to here then here also there are total four notes are present okay so that's it for this video in next video i will show you how to work on admin feedback page okay so thanks for watching this video please like share this video and also subscribe my channel see you soon in next video